Hey friends, this is Gaurish and welcome to the winning side. In this video, we are going to create a team for match between Chigga Vikings and Dhaka Dynamites. Dhaka Dynamites are coming into this match on the back of two back-to-back -back victories where Chigga Vikings have lost their last match. So they would like to improve their performance to win this match. Now coming to the team. In wicketkeeper section, we have two good options in Luke Ranchi from Vikings and Jauru Al Islam from Dynamites. Islam performed really well in last match to win the match for his team. He was the man of the match in that match. But he come to bat in a middle order whereas Ronchi is a top order batsman and he is a more destructive batsman. So I am selecting him in my team. Here yeah, Sangakara may get a chance in this match but his selection is 50-50 so I am not taking risks with him. In batting section. From Dhaka Dynamites, Evan Lewis will surely play. He is opening for them. Cameron Delport, I'm, I have doubt about his uh, participation in next match because uh, his performance in last two matches was not that good. So he may be dropped from the team and Sangakara may get a chance. So I would not suggest you to pick him in your team. Polar uh, played a match winning inning in last match. So he is informed player now. So I would suggest you to pick him in your team. So from Dhaka, I am selecting Evan Lewis and Kiran Pollard in my team. From Chidga Vikings, we have options between Mizbah Ulak, Soumya Sarkar, Anamul Haq and Dilshan Munvira. I am going with Soumya Sarkar and Munavira because Sarkar is a domestic player so he will surely play. And Munavira, even though he are given in batting section, he is more of an all-rounder. So he will give you points in batting as well as bowling. He actually opened the bowling for Vikings in last match. And he also come to bat at one down. So he can give you maximum points on his day. In all-rounder section, uh, from Vikings, we have Sikandar Raja. As there was an option of Ruiz, but uh, Luis Ruiz did not play in last match, so Raza is the only option from Vikings, and I am selecting him in my team. From Dynamites, we have three good options in Shahid Afridi, Shakib Al Hassan, and Sunil Narin. Due to credit issue, I could not pick Hassan in my team, but Afridi and Narin are very good choices, especially Afridi, and I would pick him as my captain for this team. If you want, you can go with Hassan if you can manage your credit points and you can drop one of the Sikandar Raza or Narin from your team. Um, in bowling section from Vikings, we have options between Subhashish Roy, Sunzamul Islam, Taskin Ahmed and Chris Jordan who played in last match. But Jordan's performance and that match was not good. He did not pick a wicket in that match. So I would not suggest you to pick him in your team. Only uh, if you are okay with taking risks. If you are going for a mega contest. Then you can pick him. But there is a chance that because of his bad performance in that match. He may be dropped from the team. So I am going with safer option of Islam and Taskin Ahmed over here. And from Dhaka Dynamites. I am going with Abu Haider who is performing really well for them. For my captain, as I said, I am going with Afridi as a captain and for my vice captain, I am going with Munavira. Here Sunil Narin, Sikandar Raza are other two all-rounders that can be good options for you as a captain or vice captain. If you want to select your captain from batting, then Luke Ronchi, Luis, Pollard, these are good options for you as a captain or vice captain. Or in bowling, Abu Heather can be an option for you. So there are lots of options to select from depending on the risk that you are okay with taking. If you want safer options then Afridi and Munavira are your best options. So this is my team for this match. For more such videos you can subscribe to our channel The Winning Side. If you like this video then press that like button. If you don't like this video then press that dislike button. And share this video among your friends, family and on your social networks. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.